Well, in breaking news, apparently there was an FBI agent working for the legal team at Twitter this entire time, and as they've been trying to release these Twitter files, they've been the ones jamming up the process, so if you're angry with how long it takes to figure out what's going on next, you can thank that person. And they've apparently been working in Twitter since, um, if I'm not mistaken, when a lot of the uh, Jack Dorsey standing up against what happened with the New York Post, and a lot of that instance, then he was inserted into the legal team, working closely with Vijay Gade, who we know played a pivotal role in the censorship of a lot of these stories and certain individuals. They had a direct line in the government, and then they had government directly inside of their um, and inside of their corporation. Is that right? Like our own government having corporate espionage going on? finding out our own personal information, even that not knowing the, you know, the private company, not knowing what's going on. I mean, they probably did, except for Jack Dorsey himself, but it seemed like everybody else there knew what was going on. So look, we have to understand the world isn't going to be for what Christians are for or what we're for, right? That's why it's so important to believe in Jesus Christ, stick together as a community, fellowship together, because that's what's going to make the difference in all of this, because we can't always rely on these social media platforms to be a place where we can talk. There might come a day where this isn't available to us. We just need a real flag. Keep strong in the Lord. Keep strong in the word. Just want to thank you and have a blessed day.